Joining us here on the news at four, I'm Mike Selim. Right now, day four of testimony underway in the Leilani Simon murder trial. The Chatham County mom charged with killing her 20 month old son, Quinton, and then discarding his body in a dumpster. Today, Simon's ex boyfriend, Danny Youngkin, once again took the stand. Our Flynn Snyder is live outside the Chatham County Courthouse in Flynn. Youngkin was questioned about Quinton's reported disappearance. Yeah, Mike, that's right. Good afternoon. Simon's defense team pressed Youngkin about just how much he remembers from the night prosecutors say Quinton was killed. Now, Youngkin has a daughter with Simon. He's not Quinton's father, but did share a home with the toddler when uh, that 20 month old was reported missing. Defense attorneys questioned Youngkin's credibility today, asking him about his drug and alcohol use that night. They also had Youngkin read text messages between him and Simon, trying to identify the source of any contention between the two. Prosecutors say the two had a fraught relationship leading up to Quinton's death. Meanwhile, on redirect, Yunkin refuted Simon's story to investigators that she was at a mobile home park on October 5th, 2022, not to dispose of her toddler's body, but instead to throw away old food smelling up their car. When you're drinking, doing drugs and sleeping, how are you there for your daughter? Not as well as I should have been. Well, not at all, really, are you? That's an opinion. At any point that day driving that car around, did you smell anything in the car? No. S smell any old food? No. Yeah, we've seen a lot of attempts from prosecutors today trying to disprove some of Simon's alibis she told police in the days after her son Quentin was reported missing. Youngkin's testimony comes after he told jurors yesterday that he cooperated with police very early on in this investigation, essentially allowing investigators to bug a hotel room that he and Simon shared to collect evidence on her. We're also hearing from some others who were very close to Simon, including her brother, Paul, who just finished testifying right now on the stand is one of Simon's old best friends. She's testifying right now. We'll, of course, keep tabs on what she says to jurors. Bring you any notable updates for now that we're live in Savannah. Flint Snyder, WTOC News. Well, we are live streaming the trial. It is on a 30 minute delay. Just to let you know that is because of the judge's request to do so. Use the QR code on your screen to watch the live stream each day. See the latest stories and find all of our past coverage from the very beginning.